It's the monkey and the buzz. <laughs> What's the buzz word for tonight? This is the premiere episode, actually, of Monkey and the Buzz. The bu the buzz word? We're going to have a buzz word. We're going to have a buzz word, and the buzz word is unappropriate. Unappropriate. Let's talk about all the things that are inappropriate. In a whatever. <laughs> yeah. Okay. In a, inappropriate, number one, is girls who are too young, out in public, with their asses hanging out. Mm -hmm. That's inappropriate. It's very common in our town. We live in a small town, in a small province, in the country of Canada, where... It doesn't mean Canada is full of these. Everywhere is full of these. Who are you kidding? Sure. Okay. But, okay, so <coughs> we're thinking small scope, and we're thinking... We used to think Britney Spears was bad. With her belly top. Yeah, that's nothing compared to this. I got bum cheeks. I was driving Everywhere. around town today with with uh, one of my one of my reps for one of the companies that whose product I sell it. But we were driving around and there's this girl going to school and her jean shorts were so small that it looked like her ass was eating denim. Like, I was 50 yards away, and I could smell what she ate yesterday. Oh, that's so gross. It's disgusting. I know. I'm sorry. Man. But it's true. What the hell? The problem is... Okay. Oh, this makes me sound really old. This is what old people say. Anyway, the point is, <laughs> is when I was a teenager... God, that line's killer. Um, all my parents had to worry about were those silky top... Well, I say silky. They weren't see-through. They were like a really soft fabric but the bottom of your back was exposed that's it that was hot i remember those days that was hot <laughs> i used to have to wear a sweater over left them when i left the, the house left things for the imagination now you see vaginas on the street okay it's pathetic i used to have to hide my back when i left the house i put a sweater on probably covering up or going to school in different clothing and their parents have no idea let's well but i don't know that's what teenage girls do inappropriate number two the parents <laughs> But it might not be their two, fault. The parents. It might not be their fault. When you're a 13-year-old girl, you go to the mall by yourself, you buy your own clothes. It's I, very possible they're wearing this stuff underneath other appropriate clothing when they go so to school. So <laughs> that makes it even worse, though, because Here's the real problem. These, young, these young girls are no longer carrying books in their book bag. They're carrying their fucking clothes. But here's the problem. They just took it off so they could be When scanty. I was in school, we had a dress code. You couldn't wear yeah, tank tops. Oh, yeah, it was the put your hand... Uh, down at the bottom of your skirt. And if your fingers, it couldn't be shorter than your fingertips when you were standing than your up fingertips. straight. Yeah. Which was appropriate. And now it's like elbow length. I mean, we're talking like waist, waist high skirts and thongs and. It's sick. G strings and. It's really sick. And these poor girls, they just think that they're being sexy or whatever the media says it is. They don't know what they're in for. There's a lot of perverted men in this world. There is. There is. It's, it's, you know what, it's putting themselves out there. It's scary. You can, Parental warning! And you, there's men who sit and watch these young girls, and they're just waiting for an opportunity. Fine line topics, like here's a line, and it's <coughs> fine, you know. What it is, is a fine line topic. Are you still looking at this? It's a fine line topic where there's so many... <clears throat> so many different voices. And you First edition of Monkey, Monkey and, and the Buzz. Monkey and the Buzz. unlucky, I'm surprised you couldn't tell. I was only trying to get ahead. Whoa, 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 she's a lady there. Alright, to the end, to the end, no pee. Inappropriate. Menopause. No, that is totally appropriate. Menopause. Women summer. don't want to have their periods forever. Inappropriate. Number no four. Cheating. Cheating is inappropriate. You and I have I mutual you, you respect for one another. Mutual respect. Mm -hmm. So, we've discussed that if there were ever a time in our relationship when either one of us even thinks about the possibility of straying 
that we would have enough respect for the other person to break it off. Bust it up. That's respect. I'd dump your ass. I'd dump yours too. That's why I love you. Mm.